and then Nate, uh, it's, it's, it's his time to make a move. No doubt, Nate Craig as well. Those three guys between, and really five, I mean, if you look at it, you look at um, – you look at Ron Davis, Darius Slayton, Nate Craig, Eli Stovemore, Hastings have kind of been with me for the last couple of years. And all those guys right now, I feel extremely comfortable with all of them because they're, they're smart, they understand the offense, they know what it means to block, they know what it takes to win in this league. And then just going back on Nate Craig, he's a guy that's shown up this fall camp making play after play. Um, he's a guy that we're going to get some chances down the field because that's what he can do. He can go attack the ball and make some plays, make contested catches, and he also blocks his butt off. So I'm extremely happy to have him. And it was really surprising when the first day we looked out there and see Will and Eli moving around the way they are. They, that, that's got to be you know exciting for you to see them progressing the way they have. Yeah, Will's determination is, is crazy. I mean, once his, he, he had the surgery, the next day he's rehabbing. And in his mindset, he's, he's been ready to go since, you know, one week after his ACL surgery that he can go out there and play. I mean, I go back to looking, uh, I want to say it might have been early in the summertime, maybe a month or two after his surgery, and the kids out there showing me he's, he's making moves. I'm like, dude, chill out, man. You need to slow down. We need to rehab this thing right. But he's determined to get back, and Eli as well. I think Eli and Will are really good to push each other with the same injury, and uh, I expect to see them hopefully pretty soon. Now, one other guy that um, we haven't mentioned here is, is Sal. Gives you a completely different, you know, option there at, at six six. Talk about him and, and what you need to see from him. What he can give you there in the slot. So uh, Sal has uh, really improved, um, obviously from last year. Um, I think that he's playing with confidence now. He's playing at a high level. Um, he's one of those guys that I trust because he's been here now, going on the second year. Um, he understands the offense and how we do things. And uh, he's shown up in these scrimmages time and time again, making plays down the field. He's a big body target. And I just go back for quarterbacks, man. They like those big receivers, those big targets. And he's a guy that can go up and get it in the red zone. And also on third down situations, he's a big body target that's going to make some plays for us. And uh, him having that tight end background being tough, I think that he's kind of taking that next step and needs to continue to improve. Great.